Understanding Sewage Backup, a simple guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore the meaning of a common but important phrase, sewage backup. This term is often used in discussions about plumbing and environmental issues. Our goal is to make this concept easy to understand for English language learners. Let's dive in. To understand sewage backup, we first need to know what sewage is. Sewage refers to the wastewater that comes from homes, industries, and businesses. This water usually contains waste products, and it travels through pipes to a treatment plant. In simple terms, sewage is the dirty water and waste that we need to get rid of. The word backup in this context refers to a situation where something is blocked or stopped from moving. Think of it like traffic on a road. When cars can't move forward, we say there is a traffic backup. Similarly, when sewage can't flow freely through the pipes, we have a sewage backup. Putting these two words together, sewage backup means a situation where the wastewater in the sewage system is blocked and cannot move freely. This usually happens in the pipes that connect homes to the main sewage line. It can lead to unpleasant situations like wastewater coming back up through drains or toilets. Why does sewage backup happen? It can be due to many reasons, such as pipe blockages, broken pipes, or heavy rainfall. The consequences can be serious, including health risks, property damage, and environmental pollution. That's why it's important to address sewage backups quickly and effectively. Understanding the term sewage backup is crucial, especially for those living in urban areas. We hope this video has made the concept clear and easy to grasp. Remember, learning new terms helps in understanding the world better. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in our next English language learning video.